Okay, yellow or red? So I'm customizing this really cool watch. I mean, these have to be the coolest watches I've ever had. And I'm gonna pick some up to review for you guys. All right, check this out. Okay, let's see. Sorry, because I have sun coming in here. But these are diver watches, and you can custom, so I'm almost done customizing this one. I'm just deciding what color hand should I pick. Yellow or red? I'm thinking yellow. But you can customize every single feature of this diver watch. It is so cool. The movement, the strap, the casing, everything. I'm about to pick up two of these, and I'm probably going to be doing a video of them. Okay, so today's a very important day and I, I'm gonna need your help today. Today is the day that I'm gonna look for an office. So most of our operations with TMF and SNE have been straight from home. So it's been bare bottom. Like when I record for you guys, I remove everything out of my living room. I set up my studio, record, take it off, and I'm doing two, three videos a week. So you can imagine how much of a hassle this is. And another problem is that I can't really control lighting since I have windows all over the place. I, I really can't control lighting, so it affects the quality of my work. So this is something that, I, that I've wanted for a while now. An office where not only could I you know, work as NIGA, TMF articles, but also have a studio, a designated studio where I can control lighting and of course produce better content. So the time has finally come. So today with a broker, I'm gonna go see about four or five office spaces and I'm gonna need your help to decide which one I think is gonna work best for us. Now, just to give you an idea what I'm looking for as a layout, I kind of want an open plane. I don't want that much room. I'm thinking anything under a thousand square feet. An open plane that where basically all you know, any everybody that works behind TMF can work, and then just in the back or something, have a smaller room where I can have the studio and I'll have multiple backdrops. And I talked about that in a video. I want to have different color backdrops, and I just think the content and our quality of work is just going to increase. So you guys are going to, it's like, this is awesome. Not only am I recording all of this as it's happening, but you guys are like seeing all of this happen. I think you're going to see the, the, the effect and the work that's going to be put out. So there's basically three things that I'm looking for. I want it to be cheap, I want it to have good space, and I want it to be nice. So I don't think that's too much to ask for, and I hope we can find something today. Also, before I forget, I know you guys probably just saw part of my outfit, but check this out. Remember how I told you in the last vlog that I was having some uh, wireless earphones coming in? Aren't these so cool? So like every time I want to play music, I just put them in, because I just came from school this morning, so I usually carry earphones. These are wireless. And then when I have a jacket, you can't even see I have them underneath. So these are so cool. And usually when I'm on when I'm on conference calls or just calling anybody, I can use these to talk. So these are pretty cool. So let's get started.
Look, this is what happens to my hair with when I use light product. So just to recap on the offices that we just saw today. It was four of them. The first one, I think it was a little old. I didn't like how it looked. Obviously, I, I'm going to remodel all of the ones we saw. And I'm, I'm kind of going to show you. I even ha actually even have a Pinterest board. My girlfriend <laughs> made me make a Pinterest board. And I've been pinning a bunch of these ideas of how I want my office to be. But I'm thinking it's going to be very minimal. A lot of whites. Some wood here and there. It's actually, I have a really cool idea for the, for the office. But the first one, I think it was a little too old. The second one, I liked it. But like I mentioned in the beginning, I kind of want an open space working area. And then just one large room for the studio. So I don't know about the second one. Um, the third one was okay. It was a little dark in there. I wasn't too much of a fan. And a fourth, I think it's, it's probably my favorite. So what do you guys think? I mean, I, this is kind of why I need your help. Which one do you think looks better? Because in essence, after I'm done remodeling this and making it look nice, it's also going to serve as a background for a lot of my lifestyle pictures and stuff like that. So the office that I choose is going to be very important. So I just want to show you a couple of the Pinterest ideas that I have. I also want like a white brick wall here. Let me show you. Okay, you see it's... it's I just want a lot of whites. I kind of want a white brick wall like this on one of the walls and I'll probably just going to put like Esteniga or Teaching Men's Fashion in big black letters. But like I said, a lot of whites, some wood accents here and there, but it's going to be a very clean office. Something like this is kind of what I'm envisioning. Very clean office, a lot of whites, um, wood here and there, and some cement accents or cement accents as well. I'd love to hear what you guys think down below in the comment section. So basically out of the four, which one do you think is the best one? By the way, fun fact number, I don't know how many fun facts I've given you this vlog. I love smoothies. I make nutritional smoothies every time I come after the gym. And I've been meaning to ask you guys, do you want me to do uh, fitness videos and stuff like that? Like I said, this is all new. Ter I mean, this fitness is something that another hobby of mine. I've done this since I was, I think since I was like in ninth grade, I started working out. So, I mean, something that I like and I've researched a lot and, you know, something that I like to do. So, if, if you guys want me to cover fitness topics on my website or here on YouTube, let me know in the comment section below because I'd love to expand my content, you know, in any way I can. So, yeah, that's basically it for today, guys. Remember, now what I'm going to try to do, this is the fourth vlog. I'm going to do one more vlog. And, I mean, it seems like you guys really like them. If you do, I'll keep, I'll keep making them. If not, then I won't. So... For now, see you next Tuesday.